Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Test Account 8899 versus Quick Turtles, and this is going to be a post Dune match. And let's go ahead and hop right in, and we are going to see Quick Turtles win the Rock Paper Scissors shoe, and then they will decide to go first 40 versus 50. We got Foolish Barrel of Goods, the Chaos Creator, Havnus, Foolish Barrel of Goods, and Tier Limit Cash Tier. Okay, every time I see this card, you already know it's going to be gooey. And then they have Extinguish, uh, Nib, Alert, Impulse, and Contain. Yeah, this doesn't work because yeah, this hand just doesn't work, unfortunate. I mean, it's not like it doesn't work. It just doesn't combo turn one. It's just definitely more of a slow hand. And then pass, they draw tier planet, which they already had access to because Foolish Barrel of Goods, but now this could get access to, like, Scream. Oh, okay. Oh, we dump Solix, Solix Effect, grab Rhino, activate tier planet now to go search, grab Visa Star Frost. Okay, yeah, fair enough. I did not expect that to get searched off that. Normal Summon Rhino, Rhino Effect, Chain Impulse, to tribute and go special. Remember, they do have Contain, contain Set which is impermanent and it can't be used for anything if we have hydrant alert that can add back or add the deck if we have hydrant and then this is a pop and it can't be used so i, I don't think that they're gonna go for hydrant here they might though yeah i was about to say they might though so that way they can like pop this and then they can't use it or pop anything that they can't use um i'm confused how did we dump merly and why is having this here oh because we're activating merly effect okay Bring out Garua, and then they're going to activate Alert. Well, we go Planet 1 to target a back row. Okay, well, now it's just like... Uh, every time a new test account pops up, you already know that they just... I don't know why... Like, test account... Oh, I don't know what it was. They started off super toxic. I made infinite videos about them. And then, they became super chill. I, I even talked theory with them about the runic fur hire deck like before anyone else played it test account alt was the person that made that deck popular that well they're the one that built the deck and then i literally took it and streamed it and everyone else tried to play the fur hire stuff but like this person like oh my gosh why are you trying to cheat like this you're test dude maybe, maybe they were just doing one two three four five six i already know they weren't though. i already know they were they're gonna activate um alert to contain three but this is just a monster negate oh i guess it can't attack okay 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 i, I guess you may as well hear if it's getting popped right that's like a so dumb go grab airlifter and then they're gonna activate tier limit cash tira summoned by banishing solik and a tier limit cash tira effect mill three mills labellion medora magma so we also play the bestial engine summon visa star frost pop tier limit cash tira tier limit cash tira effect to mill two Chain Extinguish to pop Starfrost in response? Like, it just doesn't make sense. No Scream, Tier Limit, Cash Tira. Scream, go search purple card, grab Solik. And then special out the Chaos Creator by banishing three. Yeah, this is, wait, isn't this just a light and dark? Yeah. Okay, I guess we're activating Medora effect now. So we're going to go ahead and put back some of their spells and traps. And then the Chaos Creator effect to target three banished monsters with different names. And then we can special summon one of them and put the rest back at the bottom of the deck in any order. So we're going to use that to summon Magma and then put those back. Activate Magma effect. We do threaten Beatrice here, <clears throat> which could be scary for the opponent. Um, but maybe they're also thinking that we're just going to tribute, bring out Lubellion. I'm not even sure what we're going to do here. Because, like, technically we could tribute bring out Lubellion and make a rank 8. I really don't know what this player is going for. But this, yeah, I was going to say, this makes sense. I mean, Beatrice is crazy. We don't detach Garua, though? Okay, okay, okay. We got a plan, obviously. Um, maybe going for a Mud Dragon. Detach Magma, don't Meta Noise. Okay, never mind, we're not going to attach Magma. Yeah, I, 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 yeah fair enough. And then we're going to get Meta Noise, Garua, add back to your cash, draw Kel back. Battle, end of main, they're going to drop the nib. So, special summon, pass over token. Yeah. Um, they're not going to Rhino. Yeah, there's no point. They've already used Solik and Tear Cash. They draw alert now. They're going to go activate alert, grab back Hydrant. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're supposed to search off Magma. That's true. Grab Baldrake. God, this deck just does so much. Okay, okay. 
And then normal summon Hydrant, on summon, activate tier limit cash tier, special summon, banish tier cash tier effect, chain Solic to negate the Hydrant. So negate that and then send, which, um, okay, okay. I guess it, I guess it's fair there because it will allow you to chain block, but we know that their card in hand is airlifter. So we know that we don't have to chain block our play anyway. So I don't know. That's a little bit weird, but we do mill Shaylin blazing Cartesia. So we're going to get Shaylin one tier cash two mill scream crime. And we don't have any advantage to add back. We might, we probably don't even have a trap to grab, to be honest. Put back the Shaylin and the Garua to bring out Dragos to Palea. And then we're going to get Planet to pop the Nib. Or, I, I mean, I don't know what we're popping. Okay, it's so Pop Hydrant, which is fair. We don't have to pop Nib because our guy's at 32. We know their card in hand is Airlifter, which won't do anything. It's like, why did you even start with Summon Hydrant when you knew that they had Solic, Tier Limit, Cash, Tira, and all of that? Wasn't it better just to go, like, Airlifter, Effect, Go Search, Emergency, and, like, try to start establishing something, and then when they activate Tier Cash, you can activate Airlifter to tribute itself and special summon out Hydrant from hand, and then now you have, like, now you have plays, right? I don't know, it... It just seems like people are messing up with this deck. I'm going to start calling out people's mistakes with this deck a lot more. Because this deck is now like, you know, we're like a week and a half in the post-Dune testing. This deck should not be that hard to, like, play. So they're going to go Dragos to Paleo. Oh, okay, so they're actually testing because they're not talking. Okay, but going on to the next game now, we're going to go ahead and see Turtles admit defeat. And Turtles is going to go first. We got Solik, Magma, Baldrake, Lancia, Foolish Real Goods. That, uh, okay, yeah, Lancia is good against the opponent's deck, because it can stop turbulence and stuff, and then Magma, in response to Lancia, can banish the Lancia to summon, so that's actually really good, it's like really, really good, and then they have Reinforce, Impulse, Hydrant, Fire Engine, and Emergency, oh, okay, or we just Lancia during draw phase, which I guess is decent also, maybe we don't want to activate an effect on summon, Plays in the impulse. They're gonna go summon hydrant, uh, fire engine, special summon out, hydrant search preventer. Now let's think about what line we want to go for here. It's just so much more awkward under Lancia, eh? That's kind of a, it's kind of a, it's actually like a pretty decent hand trap against this deck. Yeah, Lancia's tough. Set? No, that that's set. No, 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 no. Now you're just playing, right? You're just playing. Uh, you're, you're definitely supposed to go for Turbulence, Turbulence set 4 from deck. There's no way the play is not Turbulence set 4 from deck. Like, whenever I see people not go for that, it's like, there's no way you're gonna not go for like a plus 4 combo with follow-up and interruptions. And then the spells, one of the spells and one of the traps in Graveyard is more follow-up. Like, I don't get it. I feel like you have to go for that combo. But they would have drawn Lightning Storm anyway, so like it would have all been pot up, but at least they would have had more follow-up too. Um, but th this this is like, this is okay for them because they can activate Emergency and Reinforce, which I don't know what they're using on. Uh, and I think they're just showing their hand that they're gonna scoop. Oh, maybe they only play one Solic? They sided it out or something? Definitely a world where I go for Turbulence anyways, turn one. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We got Solic, Agito, Havnus, Lancia, Eradicator. Yep, I mean, you'll have that, like, when you play regular tier, like 40 card tier, this, like, almost never happens, but once you add 10 more cards to the deck and you start adding, like, crazy stuff in it, you're going to start having this stuff happen more. Um, but that's just, that'll happen. And we saw multiple side deck cards too. Uh, they got Draw, Hydrant, Contain, Extinguish, and Airlifter. So Set Solic, Eradicator, Pass, Draw Phase, Lancio. And then Normal Summon, Airlifter, Effect, Chain Havnus. What do we mill? What do we mill? What do we mill? Shaylin Magma. Um, okay, so they're going to grab Emergency. New chain link, Shaylin effect, put back Shaylin magma, summon out mud dragon. Okay, they're actually going to search for the field spell. 
I guess that's so that way they can beat over mud. Doesn't really seem that important though. Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, you're not even gonna beat over mud there. You're beating over half. Okay, well, wouldn't you also beat over mud there anyways? Cause like, mud's scary cause it's level four and stops you from targeting their stuff. But they're gonna select the airlifter and then have this effect to put back and summon out Dragos to Palea. And then, yeah, not summoning it to an Anima Zone. And then normal summon Hydrant. Hydrant effect goes search Preventer. Because otherwise, right there, Anima, like, forces Dragos to Palea. But search out Preventer. Um, okay, goes for this. Over Turbulence. And then Preventer. I guess they have Dragos to Palea, so, like... It's just not that good. They said, sheesh, big thing. Okay, so they're just going to set and pass. They could have, what, made Link 1, and then special out, high, or special out Preventer, now use those, make Link 2. What do you link up into? Like, a Cerberus or Nightmare Phoenix? I guess Cerberus, if you play it, Cerberus wouldn't be bad there. Forces Dragos to Paleo, then you have four bodies. Or you probably just have three bodies and then pass with Hydrant on field. Nah, that doesn't seem that great, though. They're going to go end phase Eradicator, call traps. And then that's going to rip away all their sets. They draw Medora. Well, Medora can uh, trigger the Agito here. So discard special summon Agito effect, mill 5. That mill's just beast. So we're gonna get an upstar goblin here. Our opponent doesn't mill any of the grave. Oh no, they do. This is yeah, this is the graveyard one. So they could activate this to banish and try to set rescue. So they hit a spell and reinforce. That's good. Uh, and then they're gonna get beast effect the draw one just to get hit with draw now. Okay, yeah. And then they're gonna try to use the trap to set rescue. They're gonna Medora out it. Oh my gosh, wait, that's actually insane because we have Hydrant on field, so that would have actually been an interruption. So we can special summon a monster from our opponent's grave. And even crazier, that could go for like Dragos to Palea as an interruption, or Lancia. Uh, also, this tier cache is dead. I didn't even realize that. I thought this was live. This is a dead tier cache. Okay, so yeah, they're going to Medora put back. Banish, yeah, you're about to find out. Yep, <laughs> Pastoral Alert, it's uh, not a trap card, and then we for sure lose there, yeah, because Hydrant gets to search, uh, Alert gets to search, they have Preventer, they know the card in hand now because we like messed up and showed them, either way I think they were going to push, it's not like the last card in like Tears hand right here would be that scary, but okay, so they offered rematch to Eradicator, Lancia still got there, they passed turn one, it doesn't matter if they have three skill drain double solemn judgment like if they don't have engine going they're not doing anything but we are going to see the rescue ace player be going first in match number two game one we got kelbeck solex scream tear cash magma they have alert turbulence rescue contain and emr tribute one machine monster then target one card on the field for every thousand original attack of the attributed monster destroy those cards okay so that's like a try to pop three so that's interesting it's definitely interesting um main deck main deck too by the way huh so you make me brick okay so they're gonna go ahead and then set past draw chaos space oh god yes so they're gonna go activate scream activate tier limit catch tier special banish solid definitely not how i thought we were gonna start this i thought we were gonna start this with the chaos space but uh you know start with the mill six not bad and then Mill Beast, Havnus, Tier, Mill Cash, Tier, Scream, Meta Noise, Regain, New Chain Link, uh, I guess like Havnus 1, Tier, Cash 2, Beast 3, Scream 4, Meta Noise 5, Add Back, Tier, Cash, you know, something like that. Or we probably want to Mill and then Search with Scream. Either way, you know, we're going to build a big chain link here. Havnus 1, Tear Cash 2, Beast 3, Scream 4, Meta Noise 5. Okay, so they do they do decide to search Trap before milling. They're going to grab Solik, draw Nib, mill Magma, Magma, and then put back Magma, Havnus, bring out Mud Dragon. And that Magma is actually not bad because we can banish that with our Magma now. And our draw allows us to chaos base discard go search the chaos creator special summon out the chaos creator by banishing nib and magma 
Mud Dragon effect. Call Dark before summon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Checks out. That checks out. Magma summon. Banish Beast. Magma effect on summon. Chaos Creator summon back out. Magma put back Beast and Nib. And then now we can just go battle phase and go for game. Yeah, I was going to say we do have Beatrice, but don't even need to summon it. They just go battle. So on the game two now, we're going to see Quick Turtles go first. We got Havnus, Heartbeat, Foolish, Scream, Solik. They have Preventer, Reinforce, Nib, Emergency, and Airlifter. So they're going to go Normal Airlifter, Airlifter Effect, go search Headquarters. I was going to say, I don't know if you have this here. I guess it depends how many good mills are in your deck. But even then, like you're you're kind of like cutting off your scream, like your your nice scream play there. But then you have heartbeat discard Solix, so like you're not really cutting it off. Okay, emergency summon out hydrant. Okay, um, sure, because that gets the search. Then we send airlifter. We're gonna prevent her now. Okay, I mean we're gonna have to hydrant search next. May as well have done that first. Okay, yep, search and then prevent her summon. Yeah, we just prevent, pretend we did it like that. Um. Make Link Karibo, activate Turbulence to banish the Hydrant now to special. And then, what, we just make a Link 2? Because we are playing in the Imperm here, but that means we get to bring back Hydrant. Because otherwise we could have not gone for Hydrant and gone for, like, Mud Dragon and then Turbulence. But then without the Hydrant, it's obviously a lot worse. Uh, we could at least draw a four or draw a one off headquarters too if we did that. But we're gonna reveal emergency, contain, extinguish, and rescue. And then set reinforce pass. Huh. Um. I don't. Yeah. It's just like sometimes people make play. This play did not make sense to me. Cause why would we banish airlifter for preventer? If we're not going to then use Preventer, I guess it's for a later emergency, but isn't there a world where we then just leave Hydrant on field and banish the two in Graveyard for Turbulence, the Airlifter and the Emergency, and then we have Hydrant on field plus Turbulence? I guess this is better though, because we want Hydrant banished, because like we could just bring it back off Preventer and then we get to summon whatever we want from the deck. Okay, okay. Draw Tear Cash, Activate Foolish Burial, Dump Agito, Agito Effect, we mill 5, and then they mill Lubellion, that's it, and then they mill, the huge revolution is over, that's funny, uh, I don't think this card's very good though, just because I feel like, you know, half the time it's like evenly, that's gonna like hurt you, we've seen a lot of judgments on evenly recently, the huge revolution is over, but not working that spot, uh, then they're gonna activate Squ Scream, activate heartbeat. We're going to hit the reinforce. I was gonna say I don't know why we're rolling with this heartbeat if we're gonna hit the the one that we know is set uh, like from hand. And then okay, so they chain it, and since they chained it, we don't get the discard because it didn't get shuffled in the deck. So in tier limit, cash tier, banish meta noise. That activate tier one scream two. We mill grief, magma, chaos hunt or chaos creator, blazing cartasia, and beast. So we can get beast and grief here. Grief will add back meta noise, and then beast lets us draw one. So grab that back, draw one, draw on the druid worm. Battle phase attack link karibo. Uh, they're going to activate the effect to go ahead and book a moon, the tear cache, and then they chain Havnus, so summon mill 3, mill scream, scream, magma, scream, go search crime, now we have all three traps, Havnus, attack link karibo, effect, tribute, and then set meta noise, crime, oh uh, yeah, we got crime, meta noise, soul lick, end phase emergency, summon airlifter, send preventer, airlifter 1, preventer 2, Summon back out Hydrant. Airlifter goes search for Emergency. Uh, still during end phase. Reinforce to set Rescue. Um, extinguish on Havnus seems really good here too. Oh, wait. Yeah, why didn't we do that? Um, yeah, like what? Activate, pop Havnus. They can't activate its effect to Fusion. They, all their traps are instantly turned off. Seems pretty good to me, but decided not to do it. Okay, main phase, Hydrant, Chain Solik, 
on the turbulence, chain meta noise on airlifter, chain rescue, chain crime. I was gonna say because we could see an emergency activated. An emergency would be pretty decent there. Also, why didn't they use rescue last turn? Like, okay, yeah, there's a, like infinite misplays that they did. I don't know why they didn't use rescue last turn because it's a once per turn. And we had it set last turn, and we could have used it. I, wait, did we use it? Because we had one set. No, we had emergency reinforce set. Yeah. yeah. I, don't, I don't know. I don't know why they did that. Uh, discard Druus Worm, put back, book, dump, send tier cash, new chain link, Merly 1, tier cash 2. And then they're going to chain rescue, because, you know, it's only activate once per turn, but they did stop it. So they're going to lightning storm planet, and then put back... Oh, the rescue is going to be used to take the Merly. Okay, that's fair. Scream effect, Merly effect. <laughs> okay, yeah, and they just submit the feet because their mills weren't good. And then moving on to game three of match two, tier will go first. We got Lancia, Shanelin, Planet, Cartesia, Scream. They got Contain, Monitor, Impulse, Emergency, one for one. I actually forget what this one does. So when it's summoned, can add a Rescue Ace trap. When the opponent activates a monster effect on field, you tribute this card from your hand or face up and target one Rescue Ace monster and you give her a special summon it. All right, fair enough. I have not seen anybody playing this card recently. So it's interesting to see that they're playing it. But activate planet draws all... Okay, 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 okay. Personally, if I were to play this card... And it's game three, and I'm playing against combo. There's no shot this card is in my deck, right? Like, there's no shot I'm playing this card game three. I'm for sure cutting it. Adding a trap is just far too slow. But they're going to plan it, grab Rhino, activate Scream, normal summon Rhino. Scream one, Rhino two, impulse three. To be fair, they did play into it. Um, they're gonna dump Havnus, they're gonna summon Preventer, we mill three... You're not supposed to summon Preventer there, right? You're supposed to summon, uh, the Rescue Ace that summons one from deck, like the Fire Engine. So whenever they, like, use an effect to fuse or something, if they summon, then you get your effect to summon level four from deck, or lower, and that summons Airlifter, and then Airlifter searches, and you already have Emergency, so then you can search the other one. But they're going to go have this effect, put back itself, plus Blazing Cartesia to summon out Grand Goyle. Uh, Grand Goyle effect, Planet effect, pop their monster, dump Garua. I mean, <laughs> uh, Garua effect, draw into the Chaos Creator, pass. Ah, uh, that's tough. They draw Reinforce, drop Lancia here during the draw phase. One for one, discard monitor, bring out hydrant, activate scream effect, mill three, mill scream, crime, rhino, new chain link, rhino one, scream two. Uh, they're gonna, yeah, they're showing that they already have something, uh, which you don't have to show what it is though, um, but it's whatever. They're gonna grab, discard, special summon, and then Solik one, rhino two, should probably also be the other way around. Uh, they're going to dump Havnus, grab Telemann, Cash Chira, Havnus effect, put back itself, plus Garua, summon out Dragos to Palea, Planet to pop Hydrant, Chain Emergency, Special out Turbulence, and then send Hydrant. This does have to summon in defense. Um, they're going to go... <coughs> Whoa, almost just lost my voice, but I assume that they activated effect and the Dragos to Palea negated it, and then they set two pass. Um... Drake type mills, lol. The best I ever had. So they're gonna go ahead, Dragos Paleo that, draw Trap Trick is for Eradicator, okay. They were playing a bunch of best deals, so it's easier to get off. Go for Redoer, and then Shaylin Summon, discard Tier Limit, Cash Tiro, Mill 3, Mills Cartesia, Lancia, Foolish, New Chain Link, Scream 1, Tier Cash 2. So now we mill Visa, Starfrost, Medora, Grief, Agito, Magma. So new chain link, we can get Agito effect. Mill five. And this has to mill good, right? I mean, we got Scream. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not. It is pretty bad. It's not good. It's not good. Simple as that. Um, so they're gonna go ahead, grab Meta Noise, and mill Fire Attacker, Contain, Impulse, Called by. 
and then activate redoer effect, chain contain to negate it, and then also it cannot attack this turn. Yeah. Okay. Oh! 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 oh, oh. They actually do play a rank. They actually do play a rank eight. They actually do play a rank eight. That's crazy. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, zombie vampire is a pretty crazy rank eight, especially in tier limit. But wow. Okay. I was not expecting this. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of thought Hope Harvinger, but I wasn't even thinking about Zombie Vampire, which should have been like the one that came to my head. They melt Double Blazing Cartesia, Dragon Kelback. Uh, I mean, they're gonna summon Blazing Cartesia for sure, right? And then Dragon Pop, Kelbeck Mill. Like Cartesia, I was gonna say, this just seems like such a solid summon here. Uh, Dragon Effect, Kelbeck Effect. Cartesia does have to fuse for a level 8 or higher, though, so we can't use it to make. Uh, small things we can't be like effect make mud dragon but they're gonna chain the reinforce and then we're gonna mill five we mill Merly, rhino havness lubellion they mill five which they forgot to do okay but we're gonna make garua and then go into the sword soul synchro we forgot to draw one off garua this monster i don't even yeah we can't even out it right if it's a wait, yeah, cause we already plan it. Did we plan it pop? I actually don't remember if we plan it popped or not. I don't remember how the other card was forced. But okay, yeah, cause plan it pop could out this, but it says it's unaffected by opponent's monster effects. Next time I show a battle, it is not, and it has forty-five defense. So they're gonna go. Banish two for Chaos Creator. And then... I don't know how they banished more. Oh! Because they're going to banish to summon the fusion that can pop. But it is unaffected by monster effects. But they are going to summon it, though. Which allows Chaos Creator to then summon back whatever we want. Which is probably Magma. Magma effect, Tribute Magma, bring out Lubellion. Lubellion effect, bring out from deck... We can get this to banish one card from each of your opponent's field and grave. I guess that won't work. We got infinite Cartesia add backs too. Okay, that was cool. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't know how I feel about the tier deck exactly. Because we saw a lot of the times they were like milling five and not really doing anything. They have a lot of like extra cards in their deck. Uh, the bestials also just like aren't that crazy in the format i mean like as like hand traps i should say as an engine obviously bestials are like they're very very solid um this deck can't make seal though which also like you know makes the engine not as good uh seal and the magma's crazy but yeah seeing how long those two matches were is about 40 minutes long and with that being said the db grinder signing off peace have a nice day stay safe